So then a few things um, to just double check when you're playing uh, Rhythm Study 1 from RGT at LCM's ukulele syllabus. This is uh, for grade 3. Um, a couple of chords that are from previous grades but you just need to be a little bit careful with because we should always be looking to improve. D minor. Particularly that note, the note that you're playing on the first fret. Make sure that your first finger is making that note nice and clear. You've got a four note chord there. The same with your G7. Particularly on budget ukulele and guitars, the, the, the first fret can be a little bit difficult because um, it's close to the nut and the string, the action, so the, the string is harder to push onto the wood. You've got to work your fingers a little bit harder on that fret. Uh, reminder then of C7 as well, that's where your first finger is on the first fret, alright? Then we've got a new chord, F minor. Uh, first finger, first fret of the top string. Um, second finger on the first fret of the E string, and your pinky then stretches over to the third fret of the A string. So do it, spend a little bit of time switching from F to F minor and getting that right. Your chord after the F minor is a C, so you might as well just leave your pinky on uh, to, to make the C. And then that's a split bar with another new chord, which is E minor 7. The easiest way to explain E minor 7 is that it's like a G shape, but without your ring finger. So the split bar will sound like a 1E and a 2E and a 3 and 4. 1E and a 2E and a 3 and 4. Alright, so they are, there's some, some little notes to help you get that one nailed.